everyone, how are you doing today? My name is Karina and welcome back to Ready, Set, Pan. Today we are doing a special kind of haul because it was my birthday at the end of May. So I'm going to share with you guys the hygiene related items that I got for my birthday. So I'm very excited about it. I'm going to share them all with you. We're just going to dive right in. We've got uh, the Sephora gift because I'm going to count that as part of the birthday haul. We've got skincare and then we've got a lot of body care stuff. So I'm very excited. Let's dive into it. Let's kick it off with the Sephora birthday gift. So I picked up their Kosas, just their Beauty Insider free gift for the birthday. It is a airbrow clear lifting treatment gel with lamination effect and the wet lip oil gloss. What's plumping? Oh, well, we'll just have to see how this goes. So let's take a look at them because I haven't opened these at all yet. So starting off, yeah. I'm not sure if I will use the brow gel just because I tend not to. I don't really need it. Um, and then, okay, that looks pretty. This is their wet lip oil in unbuttoned. So we can also give that one a try. So I'm looking forward to at least playing with, oh gosh, it's stuck. I'm looking forward to playing with the lip oil. Uh, and then we'll kind of see what I decide to do with the brow gel. Uh, getting into the actual birthday gifts now, I do have some wonderful glow recipe. I asked for the toner because I am getting a little bit low on non-exfoliating toners. So I figured, you know, we'll throw this one out there. I've used up, well, how many of these have I used up? Have I used, I don't think I've used the full size before, but I have used like two or three of like little minis. Yeah, I haven't used the full size, but here it is in all its glory. It is watermelon goodness. Yep, smells great. I am looking forward to playing with this one. I have a few other toners I want to get through first, but again, I don't have a lot of non-exfoliating toners, and that's what this one will be good for. And just like the bottle. I love the bottle. It's just so nice to hold. They did such a great job with this. The next item I got was one of the limited edition Sol de Janeiro Summer Scents. So this one is the Kuroka Crush. Kuroka Crush. Uh, this is their perfume mist and this one smells pretty good. I did go in store. I smelled all three of them. One was meh, just like eh, not really my thing. One was all right. This one I liked though. This one has set notes of crisp pear, pink violet, and white cedar wood. It's the pear note. It's the pear note that made me want to request this for my birthday. So I did. And now I have two Sol de Janeiro's and this one, and then of course, the classic original 62. All right, and then there, I kind of put out a blanket request for like shower gels, body scrubs, body creams, body butters, in specific scents. So one of the scents I requested was chocolate. And so I received this guy here, which is something I actually had looked at in store, but opted not to buy with the size of my collection. This is from Vaseline. This is their Coco Radiant Rich Body Butter. Um, my sister-in-law who gave this to me, she's used it up before. She said it really smells like chocolate. And you know what? Yeah, it kind of does. So I'm excited to play with this. Chocolate is going to be more of like a winter scent for me. Um, but yeah, we got 227 grams. It's a, it's a nice little cute jar. I'm excited for this guy. Then the other scent routine I requested was a pear scent. Because again, chocolate and pear, I like those scents. I just have a really hard time finding them. So I also received, and this is such a pretty collection, from Bath and Body Works dressed in white, which is part of their wedding collection. Now this has set notes of pear blossoms, ivory gardenia, and satin woods. So the thought process here, the pear blossom really smelled more like pear. Uh, let's take a look at this one first. So that basic kind of tough packaging we've seen with like champagne toast and others. Um, pretty, pretty blue color. This is a stronger scent than the body cream. That's a very interesting scent there. So we'll give that one a shot. And of course that's gonna pair with this beautiful, beautiful packaging of dressed in white. And this one's a little bit softer. I wonder if the pear's coming through more on the body cream, but we'll play with them, we'll see. 
but it's just it's so pretty and then i've been seeing so many people with their hygiene project use it up it's tree hot body scrubs tree hot body scrubs tree hot body scrubs and they didn't really exist and it was only like a like less than a week before my birthday where i finally started seeing them in stores which was like i lost my mind i got really excited i started texting people like this is on my birthday list so i got two tree hut scrubs and i'm very excited to test them out so the first one I got was this guy right here. So, so this is the Tree Hatch Shea Sugar Scrub in Cotton Candy. Uh, this one, beautiful pink sparkly package. Uh, get into it, like, oh, perfect. And it does smell good. Probably not the first choice I would have picked up for myself. However, my mom did specifically mention, like, she wanted this one that kind of pushed me outside my comfort zone a little bit. And I did smell this one in store, like, when I first saw them, and I did enjoy the scent. So this is going to be great fun to play with. The final item I'm going to share with you guys today was the watermelon version of the Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. Again, this one... <laughs> really does look like watermelon. They do a great job in terms of that packaging. Ooh, hydrate and glow with niacinamide. That's fun. What does this one say? Nothing. Okay, so one of the little extra special about the watermelon, I suppose. Again, brand new, untouched. Oh, that smells so good. Smells so good. Now, the problem though, <laughs> uh, as you guys know, in my hygiene project, use it up. I do have a watermelon routine right now. It is the oh no, not Olay. It's Nivea Fresh Blends. It's like watermelon, mint, coconut milk. So that's a shower gel, and then I have pink watermelon from Bath and Body Works as a body lotion. Now I do already have a scrub in that project. I just rolled in Gangnam, and that's kind of getting paired with my pear-ish routine. Um, I'm using it with Gangnam Fresh, which has a pear note, and Poppy, which has a pear note, although that's really coming across more of a floral. So I still have a scrub, but like it's watermelon. It goes perfectly with the watermelon scent. So I don't really know what I'm going to do. Um, I might, well, I want to get the Gangnam Scrub finished first. Uh, but I might just kind of ignore the watermelon set for now until that scrub is finished and then start pairing it with this because got to use the watermelon scrub with the watermelon routine. So that might be some trouble. Um, we'll see how much that's going to foreshadow my kind of update slash finale slash intro because uh, you know how my hygiene projects use it work. Because you guys know how my hygiene projects use it up to work. I do a two month project and this month is the finale for my like, spring transition to summer because um, that was May, June. And then I'll be doing my intro for July, August in the same video. So don't be surprised if you see this either have some progress on it or if I just end up rolling it in for July, August use without watermelon routine. Yeah, that got me in trouble. As soon as I saw this, I'm like, oh, but I'm using watermelon right now, and this would go so well together. But there we go. Birthday haul, so very exciting stuff. So again, some of these things I did specifically ask for, right? The Sol de Janeiro spray, the Tree Hut body scrubs. I just gave product categories. Again, pear routines, chocolate routines, Tree Hut scrubs. So I'm very, very grateful for these gifts I received and I'm so excited to use them and to have them featured most likely in my hygiene project use it up. But that's gonna wrap up today's video. So let me know all of your thoughts down in the comments below and I look forward to seeing you guys in my next video very soon. Have a wonderful day.